in tradition, with a history of excellence in education. This is Fishburn Military School in Waynesboro, Virginia, a school for the 1990s and beyond. Nestled in the Shenandoah Valley of Virginia, the regal Blue Ridge Mountains as a backdrop, Fishburn Military School has prepared young men for higher education for more than a century. The oldest military school in Virginia, Fishburn is accredited by the Southern Association of Colleges and Schools. The Corps of Cadets today numbers 200, affording small classes and individualized attention. Relays! First call classes, four in five minutes! Established in 1879, Fishburn has maintained the high standards set by its founder. Professor James Abbott Fishburn wrote, it is my purpose to have an institution which shall rank as first class in everything that constitutes true worth. Remember the hydraulic system? Today, Fishburne's excellent here, faculty and management staff carry on what that legacy. People come to Fishburne because they are looking for an environment in which they can grow academically, physically, and in terms of character. Uh, we approach uh, our academic endeavors with modern equipment and modern techniques. However, the tradition that the school has formed through all these years pervades everything that goes on here. Fishburn offers a traditional and rigorous academic program for grades eight through 12. In small classes, never exceeding 15 students, cadets master computer skills, explore the bounds of modern science, and learn foreign languages. Along with English, social sciences, and mathematics curriculums, cadets fulfill all the required courses for a quality high school diploma. The extensive college admission and career program helps each young man achieve his post-high school goals. Not only are they prepared to study and to do the hard work that it takes to be successful in college, but I think they're prepared to deal with the day-to-day -day, um, life situations. The military experience is used as a framework to instill confidence and self-esteem in the cadets. It teaches leadership, self-discipline, time management, order, and respect for authority. Sir, the Fisher Military School Hudson's Rifles Silent Drill Team requests permission to use the front parapet for trick drill. Howdy on, sir. Thank you, sir. We are not uh, in the business of rearing soldiers or selling the Army. Our job is to teach these young men through the military system, and it is a very good teacher, skills which will help them to become productive citizens when they reach adulthood. The junior ROTC program remains one of the finest in the country, continuously earning the Defense Department's highest classification, honor unit with distinction. Along with academics and military training, a Fishburn cadet rounds out his education through a variety of extracurricular activities. There's things about life you can't learn in a classroom. You learn to teamwork and, and uh, how to overcome losses. So there's valuable lessons to be learned in, in all the athletics. Fishburn is considered a powerhouse in the Virginia Independent Conference. Cadets participate in all sports, football, soccer, basketball, golf, and tennis. Other extracurricular activities available to cadets include baseball, cross country, track, wrestling, equestrian events, theater, and the rifle team. One thing that I really noticed is that the friendships that I've made, I still have, and I'm sure I'll have these friendships for the rest of my life. Campus life begins in the dormitory. Cadets' rooms surround the pleasantly landscaped quadrangle. This barracks building also includes classrooms, an indoor swimming pool, and a modern cafeteria where cadets are served three nutritious meals a day. A breezeway joins the barracks to the administration building, which houses faculty offices, additional classrooms, a gymnasium, and the rifle range. The library is a separate building where students come to study and research. 
It also contains Fishburne's computer center, the art classroom, and a modern photography lab. The campus is located in the heart of Waynesboro, and Fishburne cadets participate in many community activities. A major event on the Fishburne campus each year is Alumni Weekend. When they come back now, they see a very vibrant, growing, healthy institution, and they get enthused. They see their classmates. They are proud of the cadets that they see. And Fishburne is in turn proud of its alumni and their support. It has been said, a true measure of the worth of an educational institution is in the success of its graduates. In this regard, Fishburne ranks among the finest. 1959 Fishburne graduate Gerald Beliles, while serving as Virginia governor, addressed the Corps, quote, those vested with authority at Fishburne expect you to lead, and I trust that you will. Make the most of this opportunity, because learning the skills of leadership cannot begin too early. It's given me a direction. It's pointing me in the right direction. I didn't know what I wanted to do in public high school. I wasn't doing too much. I didn't, I didn't think I was going to go to college then or anything, and Fishburne's really prepared me for that. We think that as we move into the 1990s and beyond, that this is going to be uh, an area of education which, is gonna, which will be in great demand. I think there's always going to be a place for a small quality school which emphasizes academic excellence in a structured environment. Picture a young man coming into this school at eighth grade, scared, bewildered, and then to see that same young man go through the training program here at Fishburne on graduation day, where he stands tall in the ranks, a young man standing at attention, alert, confident, and ready to take on the world when he leaves. 